everybody, welcome to Spoiler Mode. We all watched Andor, and we're going to talk about it. No holds barred. No mm-hmm. holds barred. No holds barred. S and Means then an ED. No holds are barred in this wrestling match. Yeah. All okay. Holds are yes. Is it co- yes. Does that come from wrestling? Yes. Okay. All right. No, no holds barred. barred. Falls count anywhere. What have you done? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry to everyone's ears. Um, we are barring no holds. Yes. Uh, also, uh, this is live for the first time. So check us out in the future if you're watching this later. But this is your final warning because spoiler mode starts right now. Spoiler mode. Spoiler mode. Final warning. Spoiler mode. Activated. And or dude. Mm-hmm. Andor, dude. Holy shit, oh, yeah. dude! Andor, Andor is one of Star Wars. True, no, it, it's it's not just a good Star Wars. It's one of my favorite mm, TV shows yeah. I've ever seen. That yeah, it, yeah. We can start there. Sorry. It's just a Sorry. good ass show. Yeah, yes. it's at its core a yes. good television. Good show. political drama. You know what I watched last night in what? celebration of Andor? Michael Clayton. Michael Clayton. Are you serious? <laughs> I was joking. I was joking. What? Tony Gilroy. Dude. What? Yeah. Yes. Michael Clayton, dude. Fuck, dude. Four days earlier. The needle into the toe, dude. <laughs> yeah, so oh my god. Intense. The car explosion, the horses. Uh, he loves his son, This dude. is not a Michael Clayton <laughs> Sorry, sorry. Right. This is not no, a I love so, that. Relevant, though. Tony Gilroy. Relevant. relevant. Tony Gilroy, yes. same yes. creator. Yes. This Andor dude, straight up. Oh, also Nicholas Bertel, the composer, who also slayed the uh, theme for Succession. Oh hell guy. yeah! Boom boom. <laughs> Dude, I legitimately drive around listening to it this succession so theme. Good. It goes he put so his hard. Brutusy into this. Yeah. <laughs> this is now a combo Michael Clayton mm-hmm. succession spoiler mode. <laughs> No, Andor, dude, succeeded succeeded in something I didn't know was possible. It brought me back in, dude. Same, same, mm. same, same. I was so burnt by last same. Rise of the Skywalker that I was just out. Yeah. I was yeah. done with Star Wars, especially after Book of Boba Fett, oh, yeah. especially after Obi-Wan, Obi-Wan was kind of Obi-Wan. lackluster. It was... Boba Fett it was, was, it was whatever. So it was good, but good wasn't enough. Good's not enough for Obi Wan. Yeah, for yeah. Obi Wan. Yeah. Like if you're gonna if you're gonna like recontextualize yes. the last battle between Obi Wan and Vader, if yeah. you're gonna put you and McGregor, yeah. On a Star High Wars set, right. it better be fucking good. You're bringing Hayden yeah. Christensen off the yeah. farm, How it better be you. worth it. Yeah, you're bringing yeah. Hayden Christensen yeah. out of a retirement, away from yeah. his wife and yeah. children. Yeah. 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 yeah, I didn't really care for Obi Wan. Kind of yeah. a waste. Yes, exactly. Kind of a waste. Kind of, kind of a waste. Exactly. Well, that's the thing about this show is when they announced the show, I was like, dude, this is the like the most unnecessary Same. thing. Yeah, yeah. And right. it's just not who I cares. think okay, so I think the whole subject matter is it it's not needed, but I think how they executed it, what's really counts. Yeah. Like the whole arching story, like I don't, I didn't need to know about all this, but it is good. Right. Where I'm like, cool, I'm glad you made this. You made me like Andor more. Yeah. Yeah. Cause it, I've talked about this Rogue One. I thought Rogue One was boring as fuck. But <laughs> <laughs> Andor good. And I like Andor, Andor good. Andor good. Andor good. Andor good. Andor good. <laughs> and like I, I like Andor because he fucking just shoots people. Yeah, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. He, me and Mike well, always that's... make fun of because he's always fucking like sketched out of his yeah. mind. That's one of bug, my bug bug Andor. Yeah. Yeah. Who he's constantly who told terrified. You about me? Who told you? So fine. Who told you? Who told you? Do you, do you who knows? Luna? Send me your phone number. <laughs> Well, here's the thing. You told him my name. It's a, oh my god. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. He spat upon me. <laughs> the Andor successfully like contextualizes and makes real the war, like the Empire versus the Rebellion. Yes. Mm-hmm. It like boots on the ground reality of yeah. this universe yes. more than possibly any of the mainline Star well, Warses like... ever have. Go ahead. Well. well before we were just supposed to kind of trust yeah. that the Empire yeah. was bad. It's right. like they're bad because they're right. bad. Yeah. But now we're like, oh no, they're super Nazis. No, it, they yeah. are way worse. Yeah. Yes. It it seriously, this show on Disney Plus <laughs> made the sacred original trilogy better yes. in my mind. Yeah. Yes. Better in yeah, my yeah, mind. Yeah, yeah. No other Star Wars has done that. Prequels, sequels, spin-offs, well, whatever. The, the this prequels... show has directly 
elevated yeah. the original trilogy and because of the way it deals to with the get Empire. into this sort of stuff yeah. like with like senate stuff and things and i i, I applaud them for the yes. attempt like i i see what he was going for and i like it this succeeds in that much yes. better i think yes. yeah and it gives context because yeah the original trilogy which i love to pieces obviously it's like 10 mm-hmm. out of 10 it's to me now it's like this that and like season <laughs> one of mandalorian are like <laughs> the best three star wars is yeah and like the original trilogy, though, it's archetypal. It's a space fantasy, mm-hmm. like, yeah. it's not you know, exactly. it's hero's journey. Yeah. yeah. Whereas this is, like, hard political sci-fi. West Wing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and it's, like, so successful. Mm-hmm. Or, like, or like Four Lions, like, mm-hmm. uh, uh, you know, uh, the Odyssey of a Suicide Bomber, basically. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. Also, w- we'll get into it and we'll talk about all the specifics, but I think that this show is shocking in its structure yes. and how it still succeeds three episodes at a time. where yeah. it's, yeah, it's like, three, it's like three episodes, the first, a- yeah. it's a four act. Mm. Yes. It's a four act play basically mm-hmm. yeah. where it's like, and or dealing with killing the cop and or dealing with uh, the heist, the heist yeah. and or dealing with being in jail yeah. and or dealing with starting the rebellion. And yeah. it's just like the best or, or, or but like it's ever. all personal. It's all, uh, it's and just it's so, so good. low stakes, but at the same time, so high. The stakes yeah. have never been higher. Yeah. Because it's like one dude's journey, but then it's like, oh wait, they're like building shit for the Death Star. Yeah. And like that you can only know yeah. via speaking of the Death Star, did you see the post credits? Yes, thing? the post credits. Okay. I mean I figured what they yeah. were building oh, yeah. had I to be something bad, to but it was just it? like yeah. okay. That was cool. Talking yeah. about stakes too, it's so hard ever since like Walking Dead and Game of Thrones specifically. They really changed the way main characters and supporting characters could be killed off. They really yes. changed the game. And over the years, I feel like death on TV shows has been really hit or miss with like, some people have plot armor, some people will just be killed for shock value and yeah. it has no impact. Yeah. And I really- Game of Thrones for better or worse. Kind yeah. Of, yeah. And I really <laughs> like the way they did it in Andor. Everyone felt vulnerable. People went down and it still mattered. I was yes. still surprised. Like when you think about the heist, it's like, oh, okay, it was like a heist and everyone went down, of course. But like when you were watching it, like when I was watching it, I had no idea these people were going down. Yeah. No, you have, not. uh, <laughs> I did on some of them. You have, uh, the guy riding in his fucking Oh, yeah. Coach him, yeah. Him, oh, him. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. But, yeah. He had but that to go. was a great misdirect because I was like, okay, this guy's going to die. But like, not everyone else, right. but like everyone oh, was. I just, thought everyone was going. Oh, okay, <laughs> they got me. They got well, me. Well, but yeah, what's nice me. about that? The, there's some <laughs> nice dramatic irony here because, like, yeah, in a in a less deftly handled show, knowing that Andor makes it to Rogue One mm-hmm. would make this show more boring. Yeah. Oh yeah, but it's just like because we don't know who anybody else is. And we know where he's got to end up. It makes it thrilling because you're like, okay, how does this guy go from only caring about himself yeah. to trying yeah. to save the entire galaxy? Yeah. Like, and it's so cool. Also, yes. Luthien is the coolest dude, dude. ever. Fucking still his Star's fucking good. ship, dude. When the he like oh, takes wait, he out, God. shoots the the double lasers off the side oh, of his and ship. And he like, just shoots a bunch of like detritus yeah, on the back of his ship. Yeah, just a whole fucking like that was spy. So and he, kept, he was like, oh yeah, no. I'm just, uh, I'm just, uh, I'm trying to figure it out. And yeah, he's like uh, flipping uh, switches to like, like oh. Dude, it reminds me of wrestling because. Ha- why? Because <laughs> the, Im- the smug Imperial officer fucking put Luthen over there, dude. He was a piece of shit. He was so scumbag, and it was so satisfying seeing him just get got. Mm. Just in the, the dis- imperial in officer the that's like, that's like, who are you? Like, let's thing? let's bring oh, him yeah, in. Yeah, let's yeah, bring yeah. him in with the tractor we beam. We can use the practice. Yeah, yeah. let's yeah. set out. Let's set out the the, the 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 tie fighters. Like, let's get this well, guy. That, that smug bastard. It was so satisfying. That to me is the biggest success of this show, though. Yeah. And it's shocking that Disney let this show exist because it is starkly anti-capitalist <laughs> and anti-cop. starkly anti-cop. Yeah, it is yeah. so a cab. This final show episode was like the most on the nose. The nose for sure. Well, but like the riot they, shields. But like yes, oh my god, that's <laughs> yeah. really. Oh, out. that yeah. scene was that incredible. Whole, yeah, Oof. but like, I am amazed that they didn't pump the brakes at all on that. Like, they're the, they're just tackling it, mm-hmm. which I think for this show specifically, but for Star Wars, is necessary. I like, mean, 
Star Wars has done stuff like this before. Sure. I mean, Star Wars yeah. originally was about Vietnam. Yeah, it's about like, all this. It's like very all, political. But we lost that. The, no, it's like all in the Rebels and shit like that. Disney just, lost okay, that. Okay. That was part of Disney. That was part oh, of Disney. Oh, yeah. I haven't seen Rebels. <laughs> just but like, exactly. The no main line watches watches the main no line movies watches it. Right. Tell us. Educate us. <laughs> well, I mean, just like, it's always it. a struggle against the Empire. Like, this whole thing about seeing the Empire, how big a piece of shits are, it's like, yeah, this has always kind of been a part of it. I just think it's done really well. Yeah, yes, in, in Andor. I also I'm think just, but it's just been done in. Like, like, I mean, yeah, just seeing like, like the Empire anti-com. side, like it's great. I love. So my favorite part of the show is seeing the Empire, like the officers, the intelligence room. All of them yes. are going is like my favorite part of this yeah, whole show. That's so good, <gasps> Doctor Strange love. But looking, yeah, just like like, s- like emphasizing the Empire is like bad. It's like yeah. I just what I mean is they don't shy away at all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like no, I mean, in a way that I haven't seen in in the other Disney Star Wars oh, stuff, well, which like, I haven't seen like Rebels. The sequel trilogy, the sequel trilogy, yeah. even Mandalorian just, and Boba Fett. Like it's just a different time period. Yeah, and like those are all post Return of the Jedi. That's why. Yeah, the Empire's like yeah, and I, I gone. Think it's also just the age of the, true. The that's show. a good point. That's a good point. Right. Oh, right. They're like this is like right. Don't move that cord it's when the there. rebellion's starting. Which right. is cool. Yeah, I like the Mon Mothma thing about the financial aspect of it. Yeah, like finding it. Oh my God. That's all yeah. really I'm cool. A, I, I like love that. Mon Mothma. Dude, she was Mon Mothma so cool. is yes. so, and she goes so hard. Also, yes. like she knows she's being spied on, so she gets in a fight with her husband about gambling. That mm-hmm. he's like, "What are you talking about?" <laughs> yeah. I was obsessed with that. that I'm just so like, so "You are so genius." Scene. Yeah. But then, oh, that was so fucked up when she like. Ag- oh, basically yeah. agrees to marry her child yeah. off to but it's weird child. though because her, her daughter's she's like into it, into it. Yeah. yeah she's so like into, into the religion yeah. of their old she planet she chose it yeah, yeah yes, it's so but, like, weird her, her child doesn't know better you know like her child's like oh you know like this yeah. is I'm going to like bible study or whatever yeah and like in her mind she's like oh yay tradition but she's a child like right. the, you know there's that inherent deep sadness of like oh she doesn't know 10 years later she could realize like oh i was mm-hmm. forced to marry this person mm-hmm. yeah. for money for money yeah. but but for this for the safety and freedom of the galaxy you know so it's kind of yes. like true there is that too i guess yeah mon mothman is the other character that we know makes it yeah mm-hmm. yeah yes but those are the only two right uh that we know of yes so, so far Saw. Oh, Saw Gerrera. Saw. But I mean, he bites yeah. in the dumbest way ever. In, yeah. In yeah, he Saw. really does. Just, he I'm really, going to stay here. I really so, Brad, Brad, so stupid. Brad, this is Brad Ellis, uh, Rebels Clone Wars question mm-hmm. with Saw, right? Because Saw shows yeah. up in that shit. Yeah. So Saw, was this the moment that Saw... Because because I've only seen Saw of like, yo, any means necessary, sacrifice mm-hmm. everyone. Mm-hmm. It felt like he got there in Andor. To like yo know, necessary sacrifices. With Krieger uh, was, was he doing? He best was, fake name of all well, time. He was like, I mean, Clone Wars more him getting that extremist kind of way. I guess you could say so more aggressive. That? Yeah, okay. it's just like at this point in um, Andor, he's yeah. like, yo, he's full in. He is like the face of the rebellion, I guess, because he's been the one putting his name out there. Like you Sagarai's. could tell, you could tell they're more mir- yeah. militaristic because yeah, they like they have like X wings out there. Yeah, it's like they are in a more intense place. Yeah, yeah. And like later on in Rogue One, he's like even more <laughs> yeah. further away from the rebel group. I guess Got it. it's more extremist. Yeah. I guess you could yeah. say. Was I loved, his, uh, I loved those... was his cool big rifle? Did see that guy ever show up? His big rifle partner. Saw his like right hand man. The guys that, from Rogue that, One that uh, Luthen threw under Donnie the bus. Yen He's and... like, yo, he was my uh, my my. Oh, I don't remember. Oh, he I was my uh, I don't think so. my spy. My, yeah, eyes inside. and the guys like, no, saw him. Like, I didn't do anything. The like the cool like he had like the weird gas yeah, mask. Yeah, yeah. Oh, alien. that guy. I don't remember. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, knows. that's that guy another thing. Cool. There were almost no aliens. There were yeah, yeah well, a few, like a but not where they don't have like aliens. Oh ever. right, except because they're Nazis. Right, Thrawn, but then, no. But then even in like fucking the, their little town, yeah, they just, there was like barely of, any aliens. Yeah, I just thought it was interesting. It was like a, a human settlement, I guess. Yeah. I don't know. Are they in the outer rim, Ferrix? It's, it's kind of. I there was close, actually I think a, it's closer. But. There was actually an article explaining from Tony Gilroy why there weren't aliens, but I didn't read it. Oh, I don't even. <laughs> I, I, I wasn't hurt. Sure, yeah. It. I'm I sure just there's some really reason why. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I didn't totally. read it. <laughs> I just know that it exists. Uh, Dedra is top three characters she of 2022. Yeah, incredible. no question. She's the best no part of the show for me. Yep, she is. I agree. Yeah, so she's my hardcore. favorite part. Like, I was not invested in the first two episodes of the show. Dude. And then the third... 
Like, really, I was not the invested. The first two? Like, yeah. I liked the beginning of the first episode. Yeah. Then, like, when he... Dude, I was like... I watched first two, and I was done. Yeah. I was out. Yeah. <laughs> I did not watch until you kept telling me. Yeah. I was like, dude, it gets good. But because like, it she shows me, up. She shows up. She finally shows shit up. Shit actually <laughs> happened. And yeah. I was like, okay. Okay. Yeah. When okay, she, and she shows up and saves the show. <laughs> like, yeah. Oh, that's so funny. Because I was so hard. Maybe it's probably because I was so hard out just conceptually. Mm. I was like, who asked for this? Nobody wants yeah, this. exactly. That as soon as I started watching Your it, and I was like, were so low. they were so low. <laughs> they were and I was just like, oh, okay, there's actually like thought going into this. And I'm like, okay, sure, fine. Mm-hmm. And then I just like watched it. And then I just kept loving it yeah. more and more yeah. and more. It was good. Yeah. Really like good if show. I, if I go back, those first two will probably be amazing. Yeah. Maybe, yeah. But at the uh, time with the current state of Star Wars, like you know, hit or miss yeah, for a lot of people. Thing, yeah, every yeah. Star Wars yeah. thing. I'm like, yeah. you've hurt me too many times. So you Star Wars. really, yeah, you really got to earn it. You just got to be numb about it. Yeah. That's just the way I do numb. it. That's I just the way move. it is. I want to feel. It's just the way it is with Star Wars. <laughs> I mean, in, in it's a way, all peaks and valleys. Yeah. The show brings us in the way Andor is brought in slowly. At first, mm-hmm. we're trying to avoid it. Mm-hmm. We're just trying and to get through. And then all at once, we start to care. Yes, so perfect. But yeah, the way they show. The ins and outs of the corporation stuff, mm-hmm. like the little smarmy, like incel kid, like, like Cyril, Cyr- yeah, like working at, at the it as the deal. corporate cop, and then he's just like weirdly <laughs> like in Waiting love with Break Bad, dude. Deidre, like, yeah. and he saves her, saves at her at the end, end and she's yeah. like all shaking, and, and I'm just like. This is a weird dynamic. <laughs> I did thing? not. It was a crazy it's, dynamic. Yeah, that's what's. Yeah, it that's was the vibe I got. It's like, yeah, it's supposed to be. It yeah. was, oh no, he's yeah, a maniac. He's Dude, a psycho. It, yeah. That scene was so long when he saved her for fifty. It felt like a minute for fifteen seconds in my brain. I just kept repeating. Please don't kiss. Oh yeah, Please don't kiss. Yes. us too. We Please were like, do kiss. not kiss. Please don't kiss. Do not. Well, she Please seems don't. to be scared of him. <laughs> yeah, she yeah she she's scared. terrified. But I thought he was is just gonna like go for it. Misery her. I mean, who knows? <laughs> like, that's the thing is, like, it could go anywhere. Like, at the end of the show. I mean, mm-hmm. we're skipping ahead, obviously, thought, but, like, like, they've set up all the characters so well that you're just like, okay. Mm-hmm. I thought, I fully thought he was going to be like, oh, the Empire fucked me over, so now I'm going to join the Rebels. Yeah, right. And I was like, oh, good that's cop. That's yeah. yeah. Good cops don't exist. No. But <laughs> Don't then, fuck with that cable. Sorry. I need to fiddle. He's a true believer. Right, he's a true believer. But then he's, like, horny for this super yeah. Nazi. The the co-op true believers do look out for him in season two. Right. Mm -hmm. But it's such a weird dynamic, too. I mean, my hope, I guess, is that she just, like, uses uses it. That's what I was hoping. Yeah, like, she just, like, sees the tool she has and Mm -hmm. uses him. I'm also terrified that it didn't happen this season. It's such the long game. The whole season, classic Imperials Empire, her right-hand man. That like always oh, has right. the notepad. I'm like, yeah. this guy's gonna try to fuck her over. Maybe, but Maybe. he's but he's the double agent, isn't he? No, that's a different. No, guy. No, no, oh, it's different. the redhead, yeah. very long faced yeah. man. Yeah. Yes. Right. Yeah. <laughs> These Nazis names. just they space Nazis just all <laughs> in the Krieger. Same. Incredible performance from Fiona Shaw, the mom, she Cassian's was great. mom. She I was love so great. her. Oh, oh, she incredible. The head of MI six or whatever in. Brad's not feeling it. No, no, no. I like her. It was just. Oh, go and finish your thought first, though. Harry Potter and shit, right? The mom. She's the, the aunt. aunt. Oh, she is? The bad aunt. Petunia. Yeah. Oh. I know her from Sandra O. Oh. Killing Eve? Yes. She's nice. the head of the, of like this British okay. CIA nice. or whatever, MI6 or MI5 or whatever it is. Um, and she's incredible in that. She's a, a great <laughs> He eats actress. cereal all the time and his name is Cereal. That's funny. His mom also. She's, she's hilarious. She's the in, in Macbeth. Nice. Oh yes, yeah. she is. She's like yeah. a famous actress, contortionist. Like, oh my yeah, god, yeah, yeah. her voice is incredible. Yeah. What were you gonna say about? I was Marva? gonna say I did like her a lot. I think she was cool. I just the thing I didn't like was when she's like, "I'm gonna stay here," you know, the fuck the empire kind of thing. Cool. Hers made sense more than Saw's. No, no, no. It wasn't like her motivation. Oh, okay. It was her death, where they're like. She's not eating. They're just like talking about it. Then she's just dead out of nowhere, kind of thing. And I was like, I was that I wish bothered I got me. More with, like, you know what I thought of Huber? Yeah. I thought of this might be unfair. I thought yeah. of House of the Dragon. Yeah, with the king yeah. laying in bed. That just one scene of like yeah. seeing him. I was yeah. like, she needed a moment like that. Yeah, with her droid that, friend or whatever. Like a goodbye. Like kinda. I needed something like that. It just felt like they kind of just know. skipped ahead. That a bothered pages. me at first, yeah. but yeah. I realized like that was bothering me for a few days, and then I was thinking about it, and I was like. We didn't see that because the they finale. were filming the 
her projection. Yeah. Like that we were we can't see her death oh, scene sure. because that's her I death. I guess her scene. death just kinda it seemed like it came in like two days. Yeah. Yeah, but, but also, I mean they had her health set up and yeah, like having watched someone die, it kind of mm-hmm. yeah. it is sort of just a long process and it like is. they don't talk much for the last few days. And so I it's also just feel like, like yeah. I don't know what affected me more because like we learn kind of in the same way that Cassie, that Cassie does. does. Like we're also like, wait a second, but she was just alive mm-hmm. like days ago, whatever. And yeah. he feels the same way. It's I w- not strictly a first person narrative, but the stuff yeah. that directly relates to Cassian, we typically find out the same yes. way mm-hmm. he does. Yeah. I, uh, I really wanted to hear the torture sound that was oh, messing with Vic. I'm sort of glad they didn't. <laughs> no, no, let me it hear it. Be- let me hear it. Well, no. That, well, he, let me hear that. It would lose its magic. Yeah. It yeah. wouldn't be scary. Like, think about like when, you, when you watch a movie and they're like, this is the best songwriter ever. <laughs> and then they play the song and you're like, this yeah. fucking sucks. Yeah. Like, yeah. It yeah. would ruin you can't, it. Yeah. You can't play the thing that's also, the worst you thing you've ever heard. You want to hear the tortured screams of children? Yeah, I want to hear. Like, what is, what is this, this, this evil This is Michael sound. Huber you're talking yeah. to. Of course he wants to hear the tortured screams. Let me hear this. It's the tortured screams of children. It's meant to drive people insane. You probably think that Werner Herzog should have shown that man get eaten by bears, too. There wasn't footage of that there was the audio just the, he, he played the audio grizzly man, you don't hear man. it that's a fucked up dog wait dude. in grizzly let's man, not go i thought there. you do hear it no let's not go such that's a, what i'm talking about it's more powerful you don't hear it that such is a, a real life human versus a fantasy <laughs> <laughs> star wars yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure, but it's like it's I, it's so much more powerful if we had heard <laughs> it, it we would have been is. like this just sounds like people screaming yeah yeah that's okay and some weird like but i was just so curious i was like yeah i I was just (laughs) it was just curiosity i was like what are they just wait dude it'll come out yeah Yeah, i was like what are they yeah they'll release the recordings (laughs) just wait spotify number one i i just the whole time i was just thinking like i don't know my mind went to like avatar and like the navi i was like what is happening like who are i just pictured like blue Mm. people i don't know (laughs) whatever what is cool to see cassian's like cassian's origins on this quarry planet that like all the adults are dead and it's just like this weird Lord of the Flies situation. Mm-hmm. God, it never really went back sister. to that. No. Yeah. 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 Remember season his sister's two? dead. They, yeah, they're going to, yeah. that's like yeah. season two shit. Marva says. Well, no, it's not happening. Well, Marva oh. says like they're all dead. Yeah. Just forget about it. Yeah. I think she wasn't lying. Why would she? I think she thinks they're all dead. Yeah. She doesn't have a way she of knowing. It. Yeah. But like. You're right. No body, no crime. <laughs> no body, no crime. <laughs> yeah. No body, no crime. No body, no crime. No woman, yeah. no cry. No woman. That was all off screen too, right? All of them getting killed. Yeah. I was like, did I miss that or something? No, it wasn't on screen. There were all those like sick people. They were like yellow. Yeah. Well, that's the people who crashed. But then there was there was like an imperial, or I think at that point a corporate police thing coming. Yes. And the the idea was they were going to kill everybody on the planet. Here's a question. Okay. Was I the only human watching (laughs) that thought, you know, it's 2022. We're we're talking about Disney. They love nostalgia. They love connections. <laughs> was I the only one that thought that this could have been a Snoke origin story? Yes, you're the only person. Who <laughs> when, oh yeah, when, when Andy, Andy Serkis, Serkis showed up, you were like, up? "Is that Snoke?" Well, we had nobody, no crime. Nobody, no crime. You can't. Nobody, swim. no crime. We haven't Not seen him. Snoke. Dude. He was the only one left in the prison, and they are gonna be like, "Well." Fuck you, only person left we're here. Gonna turn you we're going to turn you into Yeah, a we're, we're going to experiment on your body, dude. Wait, but then how does he become a Nazi? Brain, pr- yeah, brain yeah, washing. Just like br- they freaking a, a Snoke. Also, they, Snoke is clockwork like orange him. Is he's he big? Just, I don't remember. Is Snoke huge? It was a projection. Yeah. But is the real? He's right. No, he's, he's, he's like tall. seven he's like foot. Taller, probably. But he's not. He's like, yeah. So they stretch out Andy Circus. They can just do some science experiment on him. They can just do some science on him. But also, Snoke was like a patsy anyway. Turns out, so whatever. Yeah. Um, I was just like. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if he like just runs that. Runs like <laughs> like a pirate Yo, thing on this like facility later. Yeah. Or something. Like, Someone you know, in chat called me a weirdo, but it's like. <laughs> It's like, I yo, don't think yo, that's it, weird, <laughs> what you're saying. I, I do honestly think it's hear weird. Me out, hear me out. Anything's I, possible. Disney, Marvel has mm-hmm. warped our brains to think everything connects. Mm-hmm. Everything connects. Yeah. Oh, nostalgia, connections. This connects here. Like, I could see Gilroy. They have taught us that. Gilroy, like, in the writer's room, just like with a bourbon, just like, God damn it. Yeah, I gotta turn this guy into Snoke. Oh, I like, what? Yeah. <laughs> oh. God damn it. How do I get a Snoke out of a circus? <laughs> <laughs> But I did think that the prison thing, because, like, (laughs) throwing, like, a hospital sequence a la Legion, especially a mind hospital, or a prison thing into the middle of a show, so often is a a momentum killer. Yes. And, like, in this, I'm like, okay, he's getting arrested, which is, like, metal, because it's, like, ACAB again. Okay. But, like, hang on. But, like... I have a question about him getting It's such a brilliant way to get 5,000 fucking rebels on your army. Yeah. Like... 
him breaking everybody out, mm-hmm. that's like 4,000 people yeah. if they survived Wait, they for the rebellion. It's nine times nine times nine times nine or something. It's like nine floors, yeah. nine I room. think they said they said there were five thousand yeah. uh, prisoners mm-hmm. on that thing. Also, yeah. just his like, buddy that bounced to him, waiting for him to show up again. Well, yeah, buddy, he. Yeah. Which it's buddy? about getting it was, the message. Oh, and they were, yeah, 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 yeah. The telling the story. Like, that him, yeah, yeah, That's yeah. what's going to be a big part of probably people joining up too. Two. But like, spread the word. The whole prison thing was so good because it's like it was tackling that missing piece of the of the like anti police kind of narrative of like the anti prison industrial complex because like the slow revelation that they're not letting anybody out such a great not, reveal yeah I got, just it was got got incredible I just like got terrifying again. notion Same. oh my god the sign language between floors so cool and they were like, dude oh my god also just Masterful. that's a testament to how well this show is yes. constructed because it's like a weaker show. Andor would have started the the escape thing. We would have had to sit there and watch Dude. the origin of the escape plan. It was so natural. They just show people communicating yeah. already. It's like, okay, there's a plot kind of halfway hatched already. Andor's just kind of like, what's going on? He's in here. Yeah, yeah. And he's a catalyst. He's the he's, he's the thing smart that they need. And he knows he has yeah. a desire to I break will, out. I will say, I will say, when he was using that wrench on the thing, they would have heard that. Oh, they would have heard whatever. that. Sure. Yeah, they fine. would have heard that it's for fine. sure. But you always get one free pass. They were understaffed. They <laughs> made a huge point they made a huge point of saying that that they were understaffed so who knows also maybe the empire 12 maybe the empire doesn't skimp on soundproofing in the walls (laughs) i'm sure they would get those double pane windows yeah they've got really great insulation (laughs) but just like the plan the whole plan of like the way they unfolded it the water what happened what happened to the old dude the old he, dude died. he died. He died, right? Yeah, he had, he like, died. He was well. And that's how they. Yeah, he just yeah, kind of died. Yeah, but like, yeah, that's oh, how they, down in the in the in the corridor yeah. there. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But yeah. that's how collapsed. that's Great how they moment. found out the for sure from the medic yeah. that they weren't letting yeah. people out because that was just moment. a rumor up to that point. And that was never more than twelve. Right dude, after that, the, legendary. Yeah, I jumped up out Andy of my circus, seat. I cheered. I cheered. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe the most powerful line in the th- like single yeah. line in the whole thing yes. is like how many guards never yeah. more than 12 <laughs> credits. I have chills. Oh, yeah. yeah. Like I once upon a time, time in America. Chills. Oh my I god. I pointed at the screen. I was like, also, yeah. Just the writing like Luthien's monologue to the to the inside man in the empire who wanted to get out when the guy was like what have you sacrificed? Oh when he's like and I have a child just like, and a wife Yeah, and he's like I have a wife and a child and I want to get out of this and then Luthien is just like what have I sacrificed? I don't have a life. Yeah. I don't have hope. I don't I have love. Rebellion. I don't yeah. have passion. I am this. Yeah. I have sacrificed everything. And then, <laughs> and then, like, and then so similar to that as well, his protege lady yeah. at the art house. I don't trust her, dude. When I the like sister came, she's when, freaky, dude. Yeah, when the sister came, she's like, yo, what have I done? I'm, I'm here answering the calls, yeah. organizing fucking everything. Like, yeah, I'm doing yeah, all yeah. this. You don't also, trust you're her? breaking protocol. Did you see? I don't know. Maybe she's just a badass or hard ass. Like Did you see the Force Unleashed? Easter egg. Which one was it? In the art shop. Was uh, it? The armor. Very armor. funny. Some like special unlockable armor from Force Unleashed Whoa. with like big spikes out of the head. Oh, okay. Luthen has it. Fucking people are cool. people. Yeah. Well, it, it isn't because Tony Gilroy. <laughs> someone asked like, "Hey, what's with all the like Jedi trinkets and stuff? Like, is Luthien secretly a Force user or something?" And Tony Gilroy is like, "Art department. I don't know any of that stuff." The is. Temple of Doom. <laughs> the <laughs> Just Temple like, of I don't know Doom. What any of that is. Do you see the stones? He could be lying. Were they in there? The Temple of Doom's freaking stones were there, dude. <laughs> yes, really? Yes. I didn't see those. Yes. <laughs> Top right corner on a oh shop. My God. You see it there. It's the, awesome. He had he had the he had the things from um uh, the the new Jedi game uh oh. Force Holocron. Yeah. He had two yeah. of those in there yeah, too. Yeah, he had a Sith one and a Jedi yeah. one. Yeah. Oh, oh. A Sith one. Wow. Yeah. That's really rare. Sick. Tell us about the Sith Holocrons. He had some rebel shit, right? Clone Wars? Rebels, Art yeah. department. Yeah. Art yeah. department sending the, like super yeah. the internet into a spiral. <laughs> yeah. I mean, hey, that's how we got phenomenal. AVP, you know? Yeah. Um, Sick. Okay. Uh, we've been jumping around a lot. Let's just... Sorry. I mean, obviously the point... No, no, no. The point of spoiler mode is not a story summary. We mm-hmm. just have a conversation and don't care about You can read the Wikipedia episode it. by yeah. episode but, plot if you desire. <laughs> I think because there's so much <laughs> yeah. in this show, like maybe it would behoove us to just kind of like talk about things semi in order. Mm. Sure. Uh so yeah, show starts out. He's just kind of looking for his sister, and mm-hmm. then he gets into an altercation mm-hmm. and kills this cop. It's yeah. a corporate, a corporate enforcer, security thing, corporate yeah. security. Yeah, two cops and I two think corporate it, cops. And I think coming Corpus. off of off of you know Rise of Skywalker, I think that didn't hook as many people right away. I yeah. know people liked it. Whatever, it's it's good. Yeah, but I don't think it hooked me 
because it was exactly what you expected going into Andor of yeah. like, okay, yeah, this like roguish anti-hero, yeah. you know, gonna kill people in a back alley. Okay, it's exactly what I'm expecting. Well, I didn't expect him to. I, it was like you were saying, like he actually shoots people. Like yeah. when he just shoots Good. the second guy in the head, it's yeah. like, yeah, yeah, that that was probably Good. your only out. Yeah, and like later when the guy is gonna, I'm jumping ahead again, but like later after the heist, the yeah. when the guy yeah. was gonna betray them, he just kills He's him. Like, yeah, Best. great. Best. <laughs> it's yeah. great. Yeah, yeah. some Han Solo Good. shit. Yeah, yeah. Han Solo shoot. He shoots first, dude. Yeah. Rocket. Ask Rocket. questions later, or don't um, ask them at all. <laughs> yeah, Wait, and like, why? I'm jumping to another episode. We're gonna we'll we'll never mind. We'll Let's just jump all over. Why no. was he on that planet where he got arrested? Where was that? I think he's laying low, looking for, for information. Sister, right? How long? No, 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 no. Later. The, the, after he got out of the oh, heist, he when he disappeared, that that's, that's the point. Just where he went? No, but that's the point of like because of their heist, the Empire overreacted and made everything super strict, increasing their space Nazism. And then the whole point of him going to jail is just that it's completely random and unfair. Yep. He yeah. wasn't even doing anything. Yeah. Right. It's just more anti-cop stuff where it's just like, not nah, wrong place, wrong time, bro. Mm -hmm. But I think yeah. it was just his like... Walking while black, Probably, basically. I yes, yes. I assumed back in the day he had like gone to this planet to lay low. I feel like it was a lay low like planet. Like he had been there yeah, before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Okay. He, it, was, it's, it's, yeah. it literally just seems like a Hawaii planet. Yeah, it's yeah, like yeah, a vacation yeah. planet. Yeah. 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 yeah, he was just yeah laying low. I'm glad that... Uh, so many little things i appreciate in this show marva and um clem being an interracial couple love that uh the the lesbian relationship where yes. it's like fraught and weird but not really shied away from but they don't really lean into it too heavy yeah but they like, never really and there's no like fridging well like, but like yeah. i clocked it immediately yeah. yeah which i always do and then they they kind of just show it realistically <laughs> i also really liked when he goes back to get his money there's just this alien couple in bed sleeping, yeah. like yeah. arms around each yeah, other, but like, they're like freaky alien like, squids, and I'm just like, this is great. I was like, his shit's been there for months? Like, yeah. all right, Well, sure. I mean, it's up above a shower. If the shower Cleaning never broke. Stuff? Tell me they don't got clean yeah, stuff. Yeah, I was like, all right, that's, that's two strikes. Bullshit. That's two strikes. Two strikes. Two strikes. Two strikes. Just one so more. you know. Yeah. One more. Yeah, I tracked oh, those. Fucking oh, no, I'm just kidding. No, I tracked that shit. Said, you get one strike. You get one yeah. free yeah. one. You get one free one where I don't even. So now it's one strike. No, you get one free one where I don't even care. But then when you have the second one, then I then I'm then the thinking, first one you care about retroactively. Exactly. Yeah. Then I'm thinking it. about it big time. <laughs> then then the I'm first thinking. First one counts for two. Yeah. 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 What's the line in yeah. if anyone can recall? He says to Jen, like, I've been in this fight since I was oh. six, twelve. I don't remember what the age was. Mm. Now I'm curious what it is. Yeah. Because they <laughs> show him as a kid. <laughs> well, but he also has been shown to inflate the truth right because when he's talking to luthien up front mm -hmm. he was like i was in the army i was doing this and he's like you were a mechanic you were not mm -hmm. even on the field like shut but up then it just like, <laughs> like <laughs> it makes it look like worse in retrospect if he is telling not telling the truth in rogue one because it's yeah. like he's having a heart to heart yeah moment with jen who's on his same side and True. shit like that but i, I don't do even know could be a i don't remember maybe. what the number well, is it could be retcon yeah, so okay, so he was definitely not eight. So maybe <laughs> well, he's just I thinking think he's... about that exact moment when his mom takes him Yeah, was the moment that kickstarted his whole journey. Sure, yeah. So maybe that's what he that, means. That, that. He probably was about eight. He seemed really young. Yeah, he was pretty young. As a kid, yeah. To me, like it wouldn't be like no. him a part of the fight unless he was actually in a part of the fight. But right? I also At think... The, like the whole point of the show, the beginning was like, he's like... I don't want anything to do with any of this bullshit. True, yeah, true, true, true. But I think true. that the show is also showing, especially with characters like Luthien and Mon Mothma, anything that takes to get the job done, yeah. do it. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't put it past him lying to Gen Generoso, sure. just saying like, yeah, yeah I've been fighting totally my lie. whole life. Just if yeah. that was what he needs to say yeah. to like motivate yeah. her, yeah. true. I just keep track. I'm just keeping track. Yeah, yeah. noted. <laughs> Two and a half, Andor. Noted. You know, you got people whose job it is to keep track of that shit. Yeah. So. The Star the, dude, there's like nothing more sacred than Star Wars don't lore, right? <laughs> it's like, I mean, kind of. I don't know. It's just like yeah. it's all over oh, the place. So it's six, actually, not eight. It's revealed. regardless. Um, but yeah, I mean, I think that's an apartment, not a hotel. Also, the I thing that he too. was staying in, where he hid the money up above the the thing. I think got that it. was just a, like some squat, like yeah. some shitty like yeah. squat he was living in. I so agree. like, I think I think it's, it's a hotel. It's not unreasonable that it would be be there, but like, uh, who knows. Um, Pretty unreasonable. I'm not buying it. Agree <laughs> okay. to disagree. Yeah. 
Yeah, whatever. I, I agree yeah. with you. I, I mean, if you're That's hiding it up by the pipes, like, who knows? But, like, yeah. we, it I mean, was like, I told you it's right a ridiculous there. space shower. Go to any shower, McDonald's in the hood in it's New not York region to be stealing and you're going to find a gun. <laughs> True. <laughs> so, it's like, a, it's not like a luxury hotel. It's right. Like a, it's like a shitty, like, yeah. yeah. Strike two. Strike two. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Strike two. Strike two. <laughs> Strike two. <laughs> Keep in track. Um, really good heist. Just a super good heist. great heist. What What's so cool about the hi- cuz like he gets out of his first little rat rat's nest mm-hmm. and just meets these new people meets Luthien yeah. like that whole se- sequence was amazing phenomenal like, it things going bad for Cyril in that part too when Luthien is in town and picks him up like i didn't see that coming i didn't see him getting fired yeah. cuz like he did do like his coming. corpo pig boss told yeah. him to just forget about it and he doesn't right and usually Unhinged. we're trained we're trained by narratives to be like okay, he's the bad guy. Yeah. He's doing this, like, he's going above and beyond and he's going to end up catching the thing. It's like, no, what his corporate yeah. shitlord told him was right. They all got fired. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, just yeah. Like, and a lot and of the, people died. And a bunch of people yeah. died. Yeah. And then yeah. the space Nazis came and took over the town. It's yeah. just yeah. like, you done really good. He messed up. Yeah. Like, your boss knows best. <laughs> Not always. Not but, always. But in this <laughs> case, like, dude, listen to your boss. But like, I, so that was a cool th- thing I didn't see coming. And then, yeah, the show just, like... Because I think you had heard that it was, like, three-episode arcs of... No, dis- I just assumed after, okay, okay, that after was, uh, like, six. Okay, that was your own observation. Yeah, because it was, like, okay. the three... and Because mm-hmm. episode four was, like, a reset. Yeah. Mm. And then well, episode seven yeah. is, like, a reset. That was what was so interesting. It, like, yeah, resets. Just like, okay, this is just a new story yeah. now, almost? Like, yeah, I was crazy. Yeah. Like, okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm like, okay, I guess this stuff. is the show? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Which is refreshing, especially from after Boba Fett. Mm-hmm. Where like literally nothing happens, and then there's an episode of Mandalorian in the middle, and then literally <laughs> nothing happens. Episodes, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 and like one of them was cool, and the other half was not cool, <laughs> and it's just like, and then the show just nothing happens again, and it's just like okay, cool. A I show guess. that should have been four episodes probably, or just yeah. shouldn't have existed. Like it's just, but um, this is like twelve episodes, and it's all of them are necessary. All you, of them are um, so important. Yeah, you th- you think about it, you know, you compare Andor to the rest. And it's like the rest is and so rest. caught up <laughs> in the Star Wars mythology, yes. mm-hmm. yeah. in the Star Wars expectations. Yeah. We need blasters. We need bounty hunters. We need lightsabers yeah. and Jedi. And it's like the show was only concerned with telling a political thriller narrative. Yeah. First. And there's only Star Wars was the backdrop yeah. to this tale. Yes. Which is which is how it should be. Like yes. the the this this show for the first time in Disney Star Wars history, I haven't seen the cartoons. Um, <laughs> no one has. Sorry. <laughs> it, it puts the the first the correct thing first. Characters, mm-hmm. yep. yes. <laughs> like, like, I don't give Star a shit Wars... about anybody except for Mandalorian and Baby Yoda in any of these other shows. <laughs> like, the yeah. Star Wars universe is already so cool. Yeah, like, all it's we just need to cool. Do it's just, just yeah. cool. Yeah. It's a great world. Yes, all we need to do is put people in it <laughs> yeah. and have them do whatever in the a fuck. realistic way. Yeah. yeah, and like, it's so awesome to see, like for people who have been following Star Wars their entire life, like religiously. Like, it's so cool to see like. Oh, here's an art shop on Coruscant. Like, yeah. that's yeah. fucking sick. Yeah. Yes. Like, here's how people dress on that yeah. planet. I My mean, favorite scene in Attack of the Clones planet. was when they like go down into the bar in the like yeah. city street. Coruscant. I'm like, give me more of this. Well, give me more of this. It reminds me of Mandalorian. <laughs> yeah. There's Watch a Clone point Wars. where someone's like something something Jedi, and Mando's like, what the fuck's a Jedi? <laughs> Basically, <laughs> like, mm-hmm. it's like great. We yeah. Like. Most people are not Jedis. Most people don't no, know what Jedi's are or Sith are. Yeah, like, most point. people don't even believe yeah, in them. Yeah, exactly. later. It's like superheroes, basically. So to have like a sh- two. Well, now Mando has Jedi, kind of, but like yeah, which kind of disappointed me. Yeah, whatever. But like to have a Star Wars show where there's no like magic yeah. and where we know the end point is. Pre oh, all that, that was like, the other thing I was gonna Luke's say. Luke's not gonna just show the fuck up in this yeah. show. No, I it's love. Awesome. I don't trust Disney. I'm I'm terrified. Of it. <laughs> I'm scared Disney. of it. Like yeah, Ashoka yeah, or somebody's yeah. gonna show up. Like show. I, I, sure. I, I love. I think t- Tony Gilmore <laughs> was like young. given this well. this canvas where like he had a point A, mm-hmm. which is Diego Luna, and then he had a point <laughs> B, which is or point Z, dead on a beach, which was 
<laughs> which is Death, Death Star. Star. Yeah. 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 And like how we in between that can be whatever the fuck we want. Like we yeah. know what characters are alive and where they are and that's like that's what we have to work with. And it like it increases the dramatic tension that Luthien is so huge and yes. so important and not in Rogue One. I'm he like, is. what's going to happen yeah. to him? Where the fuck is he? He can die at any time. Yes. So many theories. So many theories. So many theories. Is Luthien a former Jedi or Sith? People were saying What that. is going on? Because yeah. he had what a kyber crystal. Here? Like, that's pretty yeah. weird. Yeah. He could be. He doesn't use the force that we've seen, but he, he gets away it. with a lot of stuff. Yeah, he could be... Yeah, like, hiding it like Obi Wan tried to hide it too. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Big, or like and tricking like, people into doing shit, Jedi mind tricking people. Dude. Yeah, but also just like his ship. Like I love pe- just showing people who have like means and wealth and access. He was not concerned. doing like crazy ass shit. Yes. And his ship is the coolest goddamn Coolest-? Star Wars oh ship God, such in a, cool a while. Ship. Yes, like such a cool ship. the fact that it's like a modified. Like yeah. Cassian early on is just like I've never seen one of these with a hyperdrive yeah. before. Like the, that's crazy. The last time I was this impressed was I don't like this movie Attack of the Clones. Those like silent bombs that go off oh. were so mm. fucking cool. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. those things ruled. I haven't that seen like Boba Fett. S- yeah, the Sonic Mines. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, those are sick. Jango I haven't seen too. like like or Jango right. At you know, time. and then like Force Unle- or the new stuff was just like oh, let me just the Millennium Falcon again. But I haven't seen like a new. Awesome Star Wars yeah. like technology well, in his, so like, long with his like AI on board yeah. that helps him with stuff like it's rad There's and the cool. laser beams ah oh, the chaff and the <laughs> yeah. laser beam thing God, amazing so how do you re how do you like get more ammunition for that yeah thing? Like, what you just is you it don't just garbage? You're not to think what about is it? it yeah or you rob some usually more silverware refuse. yeah you <laughs> rob some oh. silverware from me. I don't know if it was in a video game or something usually that shit is a battery. It was like Knights of the Old Republic or well, something. Well, the chaff thing no, is, the yeah. Stuff that the, they the, oh, the lasers things? are a battery yeah, that had to charge. Yeah, like stop at the local dump. Probably like, salvage. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I like, think it is probably just like sick. yeah, whatever. Yeah. Um, I was gonna say, uh, it's fun. It's interesting hearing you all talk about how you like that. It's like character first. I think that's a good part of the show is, yeah. And how a strength it is. We're getting closer and closer and closer to Star Wars storylines. Yeah. Don't be surprised if more starts coming in season two. Oh, yeah, for oh, sure, yeah. for sure. But, like... Chewbacca showing up. But, like, Stop. here's the <laughs> thing, though. Here's the difference. And, like, yeah, there are some uh, some characters that are part of the Rebellion that, like, get intertwined. And, like, what what the difference is now, though, Brad, mm-hmm. is, like... Season one, yeah. I, I trust this show oh, more. Oh, sure. Like, yeah. I trust Gilroy to not fuck that sure. up. Yeah. And not do it in some stupid way where it's just, like, here's Luke! You know, it's just like, mm-hmm. I don't know. Parasite level expectations now. True, though. true. Yeah. <laughs> just be careful. You know? Yeah, the stakes have just never be been careful. higher. Yeah, we went in just like, whatever. Hope yeah. it's good. We w- no, we went in actively like, fuck yeah. this show. Like, oh, and or, are you serious? Yeah, yeah, yeah I wasn't going to watch it. Going to yeah. watch I didn't it. watch it for like six episodes. Yeah. Now it's, I started now it's like, it late. Okay. And now it's like my favorite thing. Yeah, it's like, damn it. I just want more. Diego Luna, call me. Honestly, I'd like it if there was a new episode of Andor all year round. Pull back a little. Just like 52 episodes 52 a year. Episodes. Just every that single week. so much Forever. Work. Oh, Those wait. Poor of, of Andor? For Andor? Yeah, forever. Just like you life, are the news. life is better with <laughs> Andor in it. I hear so, what you're saying, but you're yeah. crazy. Think about those poor writers. Also, how much money can't Disney would have to spend? Yeah. It, um... Also, Andy Serkis was really good. Slaying. She was like, super dude, good. I, actually, I forget he's a good actor. I yeah. laughed out loud when he came to the yeah, show. Yeah, when he showed up, I was, I was like, like huh? oh, they fucked him over in episode eight, so now they're going to give him a second chance. Yeah. Here's your paycheck, bud. I just kept thinking but of he was, Snoke, He man. did great. Yeah. Dude, it could, I know. Andy Serkis is awesome. Well. It can happen. It totally can. He is not Snoke. I mean, because that would be <laughs> like so they, years If later. they could turn the Force, which was called a dying religion in episode four, to something just boiling down to metachlorians, like anything could happen. Yeah. <laughs> anything could fucking yeah, happen. It's so this. stupid. Yeah, Star Wars is not is literally mess. rewriting your own shit. Yes. Yeah. Um, if Snoke shows up, dude. But like, this is like sixty off. years before the Force Awakens. Sixty? Uh, no. No, no, less, way less than 40? No, no way. 100? No, no, no. I, mean, no, I don't no. know. I don't remember. Luke's probably yeah, like, it's like they were 20. Like, oh, yeah, Luke's, Luke's, yeah, Luke's yeah, like yeah, yeah. 17 probably <laughs> yeah. or 16. All right, all right, right. All right. So uh, 30 years. All right, whatever. Yeah, Never it's mind. Like probably like 30. Well, then, then them being all like 35. everyone's a legend from the original trilogy was kind of weird in the new trilogy then. 
Why? Because that seems like more time had passed. But oh, I mean, in a but huge, humongous also... galaxy and shit. Yeah, like I suppose. when and you think about the time from funny. Jedi to sorry, uh, Revenge of the Sith to A New Hope, it's like Jedi are like a myth at that point. Yeah. Also, and it's been like, like twenty years. The way information suppose, is, it's just is a big passed galaxy. around. The, yeah. yeah, exactly. Yeah, the way yeah, information yeah, is yeah. passed around the galaxy, like yeah, yeah, yeah. the Empire could, if they want, basically True. pretend that they never existed. It's being suppressed Thought actively. Yeah, 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 for sure. All right, all right, all right. Never mind. Thought crime, dude. <laughs> Minority Report. Oh. What's up? <laughs> Precogs. Hell yeah. Never seen it. Yeah. It's good. Sick I'm, movie. Isn't Thought Crime a thing in 1984? Too? Yeah. Okay, okay. Yep. 1984 too? One of the Thought few books I've read. <laughs> Thought Crime is not in Minority Report. It's pre crime. Yeah, oh. yeah, yeah, yeah. But. Um, There's a 1984 too? Yeah. Let's Let's go 1986. <laughs> Most hated character by far was that fucking scumbag Imperial second in command that was just like at the end in the riots. Oh. Get him! Get him! Oh, Wait, putting like the blonde the hair. Yeah, blonde the hair. He was, he he was, was like throughout. The guy just Most throughout. hated character. Yeah, yeah. Piece of shit. True even... believer Imperial scum. Hated his guts. Want him dead. I mean, you're not supposed to like any yeah. of them. They're, They're all bad. <laughs> bad They're all bad. Yeah. But I'm just saying, biggest villain. Hated him. No, not the biggest villain. Hated All the guts. super Nazis. A A e he was. He was the one. A-E-A-B. He was like one of the main Dedra. guys on the front lines. D okay, sure, but Dedra was torturing Dedra, people. Dedra, it's and... weird how much I love her, you know? It, she like, is a super Nazi. I know. Also, it the Nazi me... doctor who created the children's screaming audio. The fact that they, what's his name? Doctor <laughs> She's just such a good actor, dude. Yeah, I'm just really like, good. yo, I love I'm to enthralled. Watch her. Yeah, he, was, he didn't make the evil. cut on this list that we have up, but like he was great. The doctor, the the fact that they always just called him like Doctor Whatever, yeah. was so menacing. Super, Ooh, like don't like, make us call Doctor Whatever. So nineteen eighties yeah. thriller, oh, yeah. Manchurian yeah. candidate shit. Yeah. Was, oh yeah. For yeah. Sure. And he yeah. was like so excited about yeah like, yeah yeah oh, yeah. He's yeah. just like method. This of is torture. such a cool thing. Yeah. You're gonna love it. Like <laughs> yeah. oh so scary. A hardcore. Dedra, dude, Yennefer. Doesn't that trip you? She's Yennefer. Yep. What do you mean she didn't Jennifer? picture Jennifer's voice actor as Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. Interesting. <laughs> Every time I play Witcher Gorst, 3 now, dude. Dr. Gorst, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Perfect, perfect, like, just German sounding enough. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Gorst. Um, but yeah. Dr. Borscht. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dr. I've never Space been so invested Nazi. in the uh, Rebel Alliance, I'll say that. Yeah. So good on cool. you, Andor. And it's just like it feels like it's building realistically, mm -hmm. which I think it's is appropriate. Yep. Yeah, and it's not it's not like leaning on our preconceived love of the rebellion yeah. and hatred of the empire. Like it's actually earning everything. Mm. It's showing us how the thought processes of both sides of this war. Mm. It's really good. Yeah. I, I also think it it shows us kind of the stakes of being a rebel. Yeah better than any Star Wars thing before. Because before it was like, oh, we see characters who are mentioned once explode in a fiery, yeah. you know, bomb. Yeah. And like, we're like, okay, who cares? We know our characters are going to survive. But like, we've, we've this, seen them be afraid. We've, we've seen, seen them, them love each other. Yeah. We've yeah. seen them cry. Be tortured. We've yeah. seen them, you know, be involved in police riots. We've seen them just like looking out for each other. Yes. Like his little friend group on Ferrix, dude. I care about them so Yo. much. The dude who, who, who Bracus uses or the brick. Yeah, Bracus, the Brasses. Tall guy. The tall guy. His like best him. friend. Yeah. Yeah, who like is his alibi at first. He was amazing. I'm looking for his name here. Let's see um, if he's on uh, here. But uh, one thing somebody said that I also agree with Brasso. Brasso, yeah. He was amazing. He, yeah. The, the fucking. He was another mechanic, right? Yeah. He's like Big one of the dude. other glove guys. Yeah, yeah. He was hot. Um, <laughs> something I can't believe we haven't said yet. One of the, another one of the main reasons that I love it so much was the locations. The yes, sets. yes. I just saw someone talk yes, about that. Like, yes, I haven't. Yes. Like, just that they're shooting in places God. is so good. Like, I'm so sick of the volume, God, I'm dude. I'm so sick tired of it. of it. Every Marvel movie looks exactly yeah, the same. Yeah. They're yeah. just like. Get ready for Quantum Mania, dude. Everything in the Quantum Realm is just yep. going to be the volume. Every single thing in the Quantum Realm will them, be, them being it's on a stage. stage the screen. And, the screen yeah. stage. Yeah. Them literally oh, so standing in a room. Sometimes Obi Wan looked terrible. <laughs> yeah. Like here's Quantum the thing. Mania, dude, that is such a good It's well, no, but here's the God. looks like shit. Oh my God. It is so God. dark what and brown God. and horrible That's the looking. Yeah. Like here's the thing, like the volume is incredible. It's just like anything else. Like we were talking about AI art earlier, where it's like it's an amazing tool if you use it right. Yes. Like if you if you set dress it well, integrate it well, 
put your lights where they're supposed to be and use the volumes lighting thing. Yeah. It can be great. Like, and Mandalorian Season 1 is awesome. It looks so yeah. good. And, like, I was amazed by the tech and very into it. But, like... I don't know if they've gotten lazier or if they've yeah. just started pumping more out or they're putting people who are less you know, it, versed at using it. Mm. Like Obi-Wan, it was like a stage play sometimes. Yeah. And I'm just like, oh, okay, you're in you're in <laughs> a sand. Box theater right. You like put like three piles of sand next to where the volume edge is exactly. and put a crate over there and yeah. called it good. I saw like, some okay. behind the scenes, Isla, and the biggest thing was that they don't use enough props on the volume. Yeah. I was thinking mm. about Lord of the Rings. And it's like they use a shit ton of green screen oh, on Lord yeah. of the Rings, yeah. but they also built, built trees out and shit. so yes. many trees yes. and props Practical. and all this stuff on the set. Which oh, the really marching band was so oh good. Oh my god. Damn. Wait, I didn't understand. Like when the marching band started playing, all the cops were like freaking out as if it was because they were they they gave him a permit for thirty people and they were only supposed to be on Rick's Road. Okay, that's what I thought. And Rick's they, Road, yeah, such a good name for a road. But Iconic. They, they were starting from everywhere in town, and it was like a thousand people. Yo, so can we cool. say that now in the Star Wars canon? Rick's Road, dude. Birth of the Rebel Alliance. Birth of the Re- Rebellion. Like fucking Rick's Road. Maybe not the birth of the not Rebellion. The birth of the Rebellion. <laughs> birth of the rebellion. <laughs> Working on this yeah. for years, yeah. like Rick's, Rick's the, the is, birth of the rebellion. What is that famous like <laughs> um, in the American Revolution? That like first riot oh, or whatever. Yeah. What was that called? It's that the, shot her around the, the Boston world. Massacre. No, that's the, well, that's the other Boston thing. Massacre. Yeah. Yes. yeah, yeah, yeah. Shot around the world is World War One. I'm just gonna right? say it was on yes. Rick's Road, Ow. dude. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> but like Rick's Road, it is funny. Like talking about the the rebellion being oh, born. I like that element of it where it's like. A sure. bunch of different groups who yeah. are like fuck the empire, but like yeah. not mm-hmm. at all coordinating. Yeah, it's not an organized thing yet. Yeah, which yeah. is so cool to see that era mm-hmm. where it's just sure. like Luthien is like trying to get Saw Gerrera and Kai Krieger and like everyone, mm-hmm. everyone Who's to like Krieger? play ball. Krieger, we never see him. We never see Krieger. He's the guy that they yeah. they sacrifice. Wait, don't we see, uh, we you see, see a picture, picture of a mugshot, yeah. hollow of him. Right? Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. But like they're the guy. He's the guy that they sacrifice yeah. in that. Other don't thing. Worry, he'll right, show right. up in something. Krieger, dude, he's gonna be in Rebels. <laughs> he'll get a whole show yeah, later. Krieger. He'll be in Rebels. <laughs> Just call Krieger. <laughs> a whole show. There'll be a friggin' Rebels episode. Also, I really liked how they changed the theme song every episode. They did. Yeah, I skipped it. The Andor theme song. I didn't like the intro. It's cool. Whoops. I think it's cool. Love it's the really intro. Good. I watch every time I watch a weekly show. I watch from the first second until it ends, all the way. Credits, all of it. Yeah. Oh yeah. Usually, Even those aliens. Yeah. Those those aliens who like. Give them a ride after they break out of prison. I love that. Who are that fishing? Was so cool. mm-hmm. Who are basically just like, you don't like the Empire? We don't like <laughs> the Empire. Same, 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 same hat. Same hat. Yeah, yeah. It was so good. Totally DRD. So good. Like, I just love uh, the <laughs> world so of good. this. Yeah. Everyone's yeah. just like, no, yeah, fuck space Nazis. Yeah. Yeah. I like this show because I think it reminded a lot of people of Star Wars is many things and can have many interpretations. Mm-hmm. And there's, even if they're not everything's for you, there's sometimes something for you out there. Like, all of you, like, this is bringing you back in. It's, yeah. like, me who watches, like, a lot of the other stuff. Like, that's not for everybody. Yeah. But it's, like, hey, man, once in a while, there's these little things that can get you kind of yeah. locked in, which is great. And, like, different directors, I think this is really a strength of Star Wars nowadays is to have yeah. different points of view from it. I mean, of course, you need to keep everything kind of in a, a yeah, circle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You need to have, like, checks and all that stuff. But yeah. it's, like, different versions of stuff is cool. Yeah. You know what else is a lot like that? Easy allies. Easy allies. Yeah, We've true. got lots of stuff, and if there's something you don't like, we got other stuff that you will like. There is a video on Easy Allies that you will enjoy. Yeah. I, I guarantee it. Make contact it. with patreon.com slash easy allies. Uh, it's how this channel is funded. It's our primary source <laughs> you, like, signal of fina- <laughs> finance. <laughs> That's make contact from Bloodborne. Yeah. Oh. Mm-hmm. Um, but yes. I just felt that that was an amazing segue. We don't have to be done, but if we're done, then we're done. I got nothing else. Although the only underdeveloped character I wanted more of was her girlfriend, more. spy lady that like killed a dude in a back oh, alley. Oh yeah, she's great. No, I was like, she is Val. a cool Val's archetype. Girlfriend. She felt like an archetype and not a character for me personally. Watching a little bit. It. I actually kind of. It's liked... like, oh, you're the you're the well, the silent spy she's character. A, yeah, she's that. I mean, she's a side character. Yeah, she's yeah. a side character. Really but what I appreciated about it, <laughs> yeah. what I appreciated about it is like that, like because good representation, because she's gay, right? Uh, good representation is like just normal people who also yeah. happen to be gay or yeah. whatever. Yeah. And who happen to be not white, you know? Yeah. And what I liked about their characterization is like, Vel is like, hey, 
I love you. Like, can we actually like be a couple? And then she's just like, nah. Yeah, rebellion yeah, first. I guess cause. she is like super real, which is like, yeah. so I yeah. guess it does matter. She's like very actually, closed yeah, off. Yeah. Like, so I kind of liked two. that. Yeah, before. I think I think I just wanted. more. I was like, dude. I mean, she was cool. Yeah, like, more. More give me more. <laughs> You're also, I just, give me more. I liked how they <laughs> let them just be a couple with history and not. Yeah, something stupid and edit it, edit outable for for yeah. a different yeah. market. Yeah, like some you know? stupid sacrifice so always. Yeah, I mean, like I laugh out loud now in when I'm seeing a Disney thing, like Black Panther. I don't remember who it was, but there was just like a lesbian kiss in the background. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Although it was like it was like one of the, the one of the Okoye uh, like uh, one, I can't remember what they're called right now, but one of the like female Dora warriors. Mirage. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, she just like later in the movie, like literally just like Star Wars. Uh, Return of the Rise of Skywalker. They, they just kiss in the background of yeah, a shot. Yeah, they preach representation, but they sweep it under the rug. Right, because yeah. they can cut it out for China. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm yeah. just like, I, I literally just start laughing now. I'm yeah. just yeah, like, yeah. come don't on, guys. Like, yeah. Good yeah. Lord. Don't believe them. The, the uh, Pixar movie where the two brothers, they're like looking for their dad or whatever. They like bring their dad oh, back later or something. No. There's, oh, yeah, a, I know there's, an, <laughs> there's a lesbian in it who's a troll cop with a literal troll with one horn <laughs> who's like a, an a, a ugly troll cop with one eye. <laughs> and we're like, fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> How Jesus. dare you? Before we go, the droid. Oh, um, yeah. B2. B2. B2 emo, dude. Yo, fuck that bastard who flipped the droid. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I love B2. It was so B sweet. Warms my heart, dude. Uh, I'm so terrified something bad's gonna happen. Definitely the number one pandering character. Yes. Oh, for sure. But, for sure. So? But he's cute. But, so I'm here I like for it. But yeah, he's I'm just saying I'm yeah, acknowledging that. Why is he pandering? Because the it's sad just like, I'm the robot sad. Yeah. that they want you yeah. to feel bad yeah. for and he's neglected. Emo like, is oh, in so his cute. name. Like they yeah. got you. Like, oh, he's so cute. Emo is in his name. Yeah. I like that he had a stutter. Like, yeah, can't really wait sweet. for the stuffed animals. Yeah, he's more, you know, well, someone said the stutter was too much. <laughs> Star Wars. This is but, Star Wars yeah. still. Yeah, yeah. But I love but it. I love you need it. a little he something. He was so sad. He like didn't yeah. want to leave. They gotta after. sell something in the droid lab at yeah. Disneyland. And then yeah, he yeah, was that's able true. to like <laughs> roll I mean, yeah, out during cool. the funeral the to like have a part cool. in the funeral. That was so sweet. When they flipped him over, dude, that was so bad. Well, but the fact that he's like part of the plan was cool. Like, does Impresso like pick him up and yeah, yeah, carried him? Or they were like pulling him? Yeah, sure, right. Eventually, like sacrificed yeah. himself. Basically, they pulled him out of there. I think, uh, but like, yeah, he's he's he's, still he's kicking. kicking. Yeah, yeah, he's kicking. He'll probably be kicking. I love B, dude. I love B too. Yeah. Emo. I, I mean, yeah, since Panda, because he easily could. Oh, he better I don't die. Think he will, though. Everyone's on the chopping block. Kill me, mommy. He's just like, not gonna hurt be me. Oh, someone said he was on the ship. Yeah, he was on. Yeah, the ship. Yeah, he got on the ship because then he was like, Cass, will be Cass Cass like, I'll find you, and he goes, you always say that. Oh yeah. And he goes, well, it's true. You're gonna take care of me. And I and I read that like Andor. Needs to tell him not to give him courage. Yes, yes, yeah, like, yeah, yes, yeah, yeah, exactly. yeah. He's, yeah, he's like, telling him what cool, he needs. Cool, cool. Which is kind of telling him what he needs to hear. Yeah. yeah, and I appreciate that it wasn't because like everyone has a robot sidekick that they just in, inexplicably understand. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, and I Our like children that children take um, I like that he stayed droid home. language class <laughs> in yeah. elementary school. They must. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, I understand beep boops. Also, just the final line of the whole series: "Kill me or take me in." Kill me or take yep. me in. Cool. Got and like Luthien's like smile, yeah. dude. Ugh. He's gonna send him on a suicide mission. Yep. Well, he's gonna put him in, in the in the rebellion yeah, anyway. Yeah. Suicide. Rebellion, yeah. But then he will go on a suicide mission eventually. Um. Before we go, seriously, I have not. We have not praised Dedra enough, dude. One of the <laughs> best <laughs> fucking we characters. We did praise her enough. We praised her a it's lot. It's never enough. We haven't it's praised never enough. Mothma. She yeah, is an right. evil, evil character, like, oppressing people, and I could not look away. I was so absorbed every s word she spoke. Yeah. That was oh, an just an incredible, incredible Shout out to performance. Warren, he was good. One of the best it's performances good. of the year. Yeah, she's, um... Give her an award. She's filling my Hux void. <laughs> yeah, dude. That void. Yeah, get She's back to Hux. Way Gorn? better. Don't fuck her over. Lieutenant Gorn was there fuck inside. Her. Don't fuck her over. Yeah, don't, don't, make her. Her. don't make her comedy. Yeah, if don't she all it. of a sudden joins the Rebels, no, like, yeah. she's no, taking no, prank no, phone no, calls, no she way. is the Tony ultimate. Would rather no, she should die. <laughs> she is let the me, ultimate true believer. Let me tell you such a necessary character. Let me tell you the difference between Andor and the pre the sequel trilogy. They went into this with a goddamn plan. <laughs> yeah. They're yeah. not just flying by the seat of their fucking well, pants. Well, there's a beginning and an end. They need a plan. Yeah. Yeah. It's mm -hmm. 
inexcusable, those movies. Yeah, yeah we didn't talk about Mon Mothma's friend. He was pretty good. He was good. great. The banker? Yeah. Yeah, cool. yeah he was I liked, cool. I liked their relationship. Yeah. yeah. yeah that was, was cool. a cool friendship. And then, yeah. and then it got like a and little... Her husband was a bitch. Yeah. Her husband sucks, but like they've been married since they were 14. Yeah. Like, oh, yeah. It sucks. Yeah. They hate each well, other. Well, that's why it's so sad that this little girl is married. Like, yeah. She was probably so excited it to sucks. marry her now husband, and then... Yeah. I don't She's think like, she... Mon Mothman didn't seem like she was ever into it, but... Uh, yeah. She's so cool. She's amazing, and her outfits are incredible. Mon oh is so amazing. My God. Mon Every outfit, we were... Sophia and I were just like, you bitch. <gasps> yeah, exactly. Really I is. was like, it's you, just you like, better... God damn it. You better... <laughs> I was it, like, God damn. It really separates the top tier from the rest. The fact that Mon Mothma's storyline was a 10 out of 10 A+. Plus. Yeah. Because technically that is the B storyline of the show. Yes. Or and C, when, yeah. And when your B storyline is that good on top, like, yeah. it really this, yeah. made good this writing. show legendary. And, mm. and and I think that's why, like, the, like, obviously the response has been so high, one of the best of the year, like, everyone's obsessed. Back room, so like, talking in yes. code and, like, <sighs> Being like, oh, pretend I just told a joke. Ha, <laughs> Like, love yeah, yeah, that. Yeah. And in the art shop, when they did that in the art shop, too. Well, but it's it's part of the show's strength that it's showing all the different levels yes. that a rebellion would need. A rebellion of this scale would yes. need. It would yeah. need, like, corporate senate schmoozing. It yeah. would need yeah. boots on the ground knocking off a, a payroll. Yeah. You know, it would need was- backdoor scheming. You know, it needs yeah. all of this. It needs a yep. prison break. Yep. And I feel like that scene was, like, 20 minutes long it didn't what cut thing? away the like dinner party oh, yeah. schmoozing scene so, you just was, like i had were anxiety in yeah, it. yeah 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 it's like oh someone <sighs> is going to overhear them the stakes yeah, are so yeah, high yeah anyway thanks thanks for watching and listening everybody uh obviously we really liked andor tell us what you thought mm. in the comments and yeah, patreon.com slash easy allies. Let Diego uh, Luna touch Job of the Hut. Let Diego Luna touch Job of the Hut. Uh, Yo, rate us on there. your <laughs> audio podcasting, whatever of choice. Uh, yeah. Thank you so much. I- we'll be back soon with a God of War spoiler mode. Um, maybe later this week. Uh, That's an cool. encounter I didn't know I needed. What? Andor versus Jabba. That would be a good encounter. Well, I just a want battle to of dialogue, a battle when of wit. Dialogue, <laughs> Java doesn't speak happen? English. <laughs> yeah, we're on fucking a new hope. Is like days away. What are you talking about? My Java's guess, in yeah, control. He's, yeah, he's Boba's yeah. happening. Yeah. This I only want yeah. it simply no. so no, that, Diego Luna can after. finally touch Jabba the Hutt. Oh, he wants to so bad. Yes. Also, have you heard about how <laughs> Diego Luna thought that R two D two's name was Arturito, which means yeah. Little Arthur. <laughs> little Arthur. <laughs> yeah, Little Arthur. So sweet. Um, yes, if you're watching us live, we'll be uh, live for group stream in about two hours, a little under two hours. But thank yes. you all for watching, and we will see you soon. Spoiler mode, spoiler mode, final warning, spoiler mode, activated.